please ask me anything. Whoa, hey, look at all these followers, Fluttershy, and on your first post, too. Hey, come in, look. Fluttershy? Where'd you go? Fluttershy, darling, come out of there. Followers are friends, not stalkers. Um, hello. I'm so sorry about hiding last time. It's just that I haven't seen many ponies after the accident, and seeing so many of you at once. Startling. A day in the life of a cosplayer harassed? You look so adorable. Oh, why, th thank you. Flutter Zen asked. It seems like you've been through an ordeal, other me. I won't ask too much. Just know that there's ponies that still love you no matter what happened or what you become. That's so, so, so nice of you to say. Wait, another? Me? I think I'll be under the bed for a while. Are you sure we should be doing this? It's for her own good, Rarity. Anonymous asked, Are you dead? Alive? I'm alive for the second time. Or at least that's how Twilight explained it. I d died in the accident, and then I was brought back, thanks to my friends. Dreaming Dusk asked, Poor dear, I wish I could give you a hug, but, um, you look quite delicate. I wouldn't want to hurt you. I can't, can't even remember the last time I was hugged. Twilight says my stitches are too sensitive. I've already opened them twice, living in Rarity's basement. The lone anon asked, Dear Fluttershy, what is the first thing you remember after waking up after the accident? I hope Twy didn't do what I think she did. Gladys's best pony asked, Do you know how you died? The pain. <laughs> Fluttershy, it's time for your treatment. I'm coming down, okay? Okay, Fluttershy, let's have a look. It looks like your stitches are good. Your chest wound is healing well, but it still looks very fragile. Now let's have a look at your wings. Hmm, they're still too stiff. Sorry, Fluttershy, you still won't be able to fly for a while longer. Now, let's look at your eye. The area doesn't look infected. Can you see from it? Um, yes, Twilight. Are you? All right, then. Let's begin your treatment, Fluttershy. Uh-oh. All right, then. She always gets like this when she checks my eye. Are you ready, Fluttershy? Fluttershy? I, I guess so. All right, Fluttershy, we're done. The next treatment is in another two weeks. I'll come by tomorrow to see you. If anything happens till then, have Rarity come get me. Thanks, Twilight. I'll see you tomorrow. Hello. Okay, almost done. Are you sure I don't have time to do my hair? Hello there. My name is Twilight Sparkle. And I am Rarity, though I doubt I need an introduction. First, allow us to begin by saying thank you to everyone helping in Fluttershy's return to society. Oh, it seems she's gotten more followers, as it were. We told Fluttershy she can do this on her own, but this is important, so we're saying this in private. We told Fluttershy that this is a way for her to slowly come back to the outside world, but this is also a way for the outside world to get used to her condition. Fluttershy needs to start physical therapy, and despite their current condition, her wings need proper exercise outside if she ever wants to fly again. She has become more self-conscious, and there's no doubt that she will refuse when we tell her she needs to go outside. So, we're asking every pony to be considerate when you see her, and also give her support. Please, this is for Fluttershy's own good. Please help so she can heal with a calm mind and ease. Thank, Thank you. you. Several months ago, 
two friends by the name of Twilight, Sparkle, and Rarity, both Mare's unicorns, found three of their mutual friends, Fluttershy, Mare Pegasus, Rainbow Dash, Mare Pegasus, and Pink and Mana, Pinky, Diane Pie, Mare Earth Pony, in an abandoned shed located outside of Ponyville, approximately 10.7 miles away from Sweet Apple Acres. The three mares were found greatly wounded. Pinkie Pie was found to have been beaten. She was found to have a black eye, swollen lips, and several broken ribs. Rainbow Dash was found bounded with rope and was diagnosed with a fractured skull and a grade 3 concussion. Flourishy was the worst case. She was bonded to a table. Her arms and legs were bounded by metal clamps on the vertical table. Her abdomen was dissected and her stomach, liver, kidney, and one lung were removed. According to the wounds on Fluttershy's legs and arms, were, she was conscious and struggled during the procedure, causing scars to form around her arms and legs. The blood flowing from her wounds caused her scars to further tear along her flesh. The struggle may also be the cause for the deep cuts on her inner and outer thighs and the cutting off of the upper portion of her left ear. Upon further analysis of her face, it seemed that Fluttershy's right eye was also damaged during her struggle. Stabbed but not removed, the removed portions of her body were found in a barrel by the table. The unicorn mares Twilight Sparkle and Rarity performed a medical spell learned by Twilight Sparkle during her time in the Royal Library. The spell in question allows for a pony on the brink of death to sustain life by keeping the brain and heart functioning. Unfortunately, there were complications. The three mares were sent to intensive care while the case of this accident, or rather, incident, is currently being investigated by the Ponyville Police Department, the PPD, the Royal Guard, and Detective Pinkie Pie! Hello, Tumblr. I'm sure you've all heard about what, about what happened to me and my friends. I didn't see who did it, but I can never forget. That day, Rainbow Dash saw somebody in the park. She asked me to come along. Before long, we followed her outside of Ponyville, where we were hit from behind. Before I was knocked out, Angel tried to help, but... Anonymous asked, Is Angel with you? I mean, you're in a basement all alone? Cat and Pony asked, What is Angel doing now? He's gone. And yes, I'm alone here. Twilight says that Applejack is taking care of the animals, but I don't see her. I miss everyone. Applejack. Rainbow Dash, Big Mac, Pink, Fluttershy, oh. Pinkie Pie, ow, I think you reopened some of my stitches. I'm so, so, so sorry I didn't come to visit. I've been really, really, really busy. I actually need to go, but I wanted to give you something. I hope you like it. I made it myself. Angel? Oh, Pinkie, thank you. He looks just like Angel. You're welcome, Fluttershy. Made this one easy. My name is Pink Amina Diane Pie. To my friends, I'm Pinky. I used to live in a farm where I learned terrible things. I'm glad she liked the gift. I was hoping to leave that behind when I left and moved to Ponyville. I made friends, a new family, but because of... My name is Pink Amina Diane Pie. Hi. Ask Teen AJ, ask P Pinky, now, Sugar Cube, who's that? Anonymous asked, Pinky, what are you planning on doing to that gagged, blindfolded pony? Anonymous asked, who's that pony in the straps there? I don't know who this is. I guess she found him walking around. He's already gone. I just have to my part. I need to remove the organs and bones, just like Daddy taught me. All we need is to preserve the body and collect the blood. This reminds me of being back in the farm. I learned everything from Daddy and Mama. Me and my sisters all learned this sort of thing when we were little fillies. Any friends I made there would be on the table the next day. Daddy would make me bring them home and, and cut them up myself. Mama then showed me how to cook them and tried to get me to eat. When I left, I never wanted to do that. This, again. But, but, I never wanted to do this. 
I never wanted to start doing this again. And she came and told me. She found out about me. She found out about everything I did. She, she said she would tell everyone. I would lose everything. It was supposed to be other ponies. Nameless faces. Ponies who only come and go. They shouldn't have been there. I didn't want to hurt them. I didn't want to hurt her. I bet you never thought this would happen. I wonder who you were. A pony who came to visit his family? Maybe you thought about moving to Ponyville. I would have thrown you a big welcome party. I know you can't hear me. I just wanted to let you know that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about what happened. I'm sorry that you had to die. I'm sorry I had to cut you open. I'm sorry you two found me. I'm sorry she found you. I'm sorry she beat you. I'm sorry about the scars. Dash. Fluttershy. I'm sorry. Finished? Hello everyone. It's so nice to see you. Do you see what Pinky gave me? An adorable angel dolly. He looks so much like him. Oh, and Rarity gave me a new hairstyle. She also said that she'll give me something to cover up the stitches for when I want to start physical therapy outside. But... Anonymous asked, what happened to Rainbow Dash? I know she had a concussion. I mean, how bad is she? I want to talk about the mare I knew all my life. Rainbow Dash. The day of the accident, both me and Pinky were able to walk away. But Dash... didn't. She was always there for me. And that night, when I was in the hospital and lost my eye, she gave me one last thing to remember her by.